that skirt, you know, the skirt instead of the full coat, which I'm also covering my skirt, which I follow a lot of subscribe, a lot of YouTubers. Nobody told me I love you. Because you what follow me. Like, I love my subscribers. Hey guys, welcome to Life with Zara. So, today's video, we have a special guest. And this is my hubby. He will be rating my haram clothes that I'll be turning into halal clothes. So, all of us have our own journey, and I'm just like out here helping those that is in my situation. So, not all of us have like just money to spend when it comes to Ramadan buying those modest outfits. So, I am here to help you turn your like and modest outfits into modest outfits so i'm not saying that this is the complete right way but this can help you know help cover up and everything so let's start with my first outfit i hope you guys enjoy this my name is zara this is my channel comment like and subscribe and please share okay, so this is my first outfit which is a skin fit fitted dress okay which fits on your body which i'm wearing with stockings thick stockings and comfortable heels and then i'm wearing this long jersey <laughs> i don't know what's the proper name but it's like salato vibes if you close it it's basically a salato so i'm wearing this basically to cover my you know all those juicy areas that shouldn't be seen and then my scarf also wearing it carrying my chest and i feel like this gives a whole modest look it's cute so usually i would just wear this dress without anything else and a pair of heels or flats but i'm covering up and i'm looking presentable and i didn't have to go buy an outfit i'm just basically recycling my outfits into modest outfits so let me know what you think as a number one <laughs> guys, guys my husband is very tired he just what were you busy doing was busy with the house stuff okay just get some energy for this video uh, okay out of 10 how much do you eight. rate your wife eight okay why is it an eight it's good, but just this little bit tight on the front. But that does look cute. It does look nice. This one it's not so eight. bad. I'm not, I'm not rating 5 out of 10. I'm rating 8. Okay, guys, let me know in the comment section down below what you rate outfit number 1. 8. So this is my second outfit, you guys, which is a beautiful coat which I'm also covering my skirt, which has a little slit. So I am wearing my black stockings and my comfortable black heels and a beautiful scarf to match. And yeah, I just love this. This is like such winter, autumn vibes. I feel so pretty and so cute in this outfit. So what are you rated seeing me coming on? I'm talking to you, which is that girl. You know, just that girl, just that Ramadan. <laughs> just because you said that it's seven. What? Yeah, a seven. Okay, eight. No, man, be honest, be honest. Eight. Like, look at me eight to toe. Eight. A uh, eight. Why yeah. do you rate this an eight? Yeah, also same reason. That is open. Here we're talking Islamic, so it's not heavy. It's taking <laughs> your <laughs> what is what is heavy and hard light. It's taking your haram clothes like... and turning it uh, into a lot of clothes. Your haram, it's gonna be tight. But what are you gonna do about it? You're gonna wear your stockings. You're gonna cover up. Yeah, you're gonna so layer. That is eight moves. I won't give ten. <laughs> Because it's, it's not heavy. <laughs> you you are quite nose. So this is a more of a, like a Friday outfit when you're going to work, shirt, 
long shirt husband with shirt. a skirt yeah like if you want the perfect oversized shirt always go with the <coughs> husband shirt once again stockings and comfortable heels these heels are always wearing in Ramadan I love wearing heels it's like girls like they love wearing sneakers you know they feel like they're that girl and that's how I feel when I wear heels so even if it's those heels love that sound and I hope so this is how I styled my scarf a bit different a bit funky earrings showing i love it i'm obsessed with it i feel this is so cute and guys let's be realistic when you go to the office and there's a lot of girls wearing their jobs and stuff this is the kind of clothes that they do wear please be realistic because my husband just told me off camera now tell them what you told them told me off camera no. <laughs> you might want the thing yeah of course we're talking about that most and we saw your eyes. Yeah, we want the thing. We want to Not even to the thing. Not middle part. <laughs> yes. Only eyes. Some women don't even show the eyes. They keep the net. Yeah. Yeah, then it's out of But it's not about that. Thing. It's about how you're progressing and what you're doing with your outfits and like hijabi fashion. But yeah, you know, like for beginners. And usually this is how most of... There is no of... fashion in Islam. I'm... So, how what do you think about the outfit? Yeah, good. Seven. Seven. Yo, okay. this guy. So he's giving me this seven. What do you guys like this outfit? Yeah. Let yeah, me know in the comments. Like seven. Okay, so this is another outfit. This is an oversized tee with that skirt. You know, the skirt instead of the jeans with stockings, a cute pair of white sneakers and a turban. I feel like this is such a weekend outfit. It is so comfortable and I love it with my top sit like this. Also, you can get like the perfect oversized hoodies from any store from the main section. So, Javi, what do you think? Eight. Out Eight. of ten. <laughs> okay. Are you in a stick tape? Yeah. Okay, so I didn't even get close to like a 10. Yeah, but it is still good. Okay, thank you very much. So I'm going to end off the video over here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, it's all about taking your baby steps. Not everybody would maybe agree on that. But I hope that you try getting my message across with like taking your normal inappropriate outfits and just changing it and like trying to mix it up so that you can wear it in Ramadan because that's what I'm trying to do here because there's a lot of people that would just like stay in the house because they don't have appropriate clothes you know everybody's like trying the best in Ramadan so I hope you try you got my message <laughs> It's so late, it's almost 1 a.m. in the morning, so I'm just <coughs> running my mouth. But I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Don't forget to share, share, share. Subscribe, 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 guys. Subscribe. I love you. Bye. No wonder who you're saying I love you. People say that I, I follow a lot of subscribe, a lot of YouTubers. Nobody told me I love you. Because you what follow men. Like, I love my subscribers. So many female also the micers and well you're not watching a lot of people I that seen, i watched okay next I time i see a youtuber that says i love you I also seen any, i have more youtubers i know more youtubers than you but next time i show you the youtubers that i, I watch say, the curly girls I that i watch say, i don't know but so I, do you want me to take the i love you out if you want to keep it, you can keep it. I'm just saying that. But I'm telling my subscribers I love you. Okay. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, I'll take it out. No, it's fine. You okay. Don't want to. Yeah, Get some energy in here. <laughs> yeah, be alive. Yeah. You're being fed on my videos here. Okay. So, this is my second outfit, you guys, which is a beautiful coat which I am also covering my skirt, which has a little slit. So I am wearing my black stockings and my comfortable black heels and a beautiful scarf to match. And yeah, I just love this. This is like such winter. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? It fell out now. Why didn't you tell me? Okay, 